Welcome all, to a new Ask a Guide video. Today we will be going through how to build your resume, using it to apply for jobs, and also list your resume on Talents Hub. Talents Hub is a portal available for corporate users to see resumes of potential candidates, like yourself. Take note that only personal account users will be able to create e-resumes, list it on Talents Hub and also apply for jobs. Let's begin. Log in with your personal account and go to the Jobs Portal. Click Create. You can create up to three different versions. Enter a name to describe your resume, maybe, my first CV. Click Create New. Let's go through one by one. Start off with a short description of your current position. It can be anything, like fresh graduate from media school, or marketing manager. Before we proceed let's save and open the live document so we can refer to it as we go. Keep this tab open. As you can see, the description we saved just now is already here. Next open the personal info section. Fill up the details. Add a photo if you want. and adjust position. Save again. Let's refresh and have another look. Next up, work experience. Each block here represents a job position you held. Let's fill it up first then it will be easier to understand. Let's add one more job experience. Refresh and here you go. Starting to look more like a resume now. Education is similar. Let me fill in two entries. OK done. The last section is skills. Fill up any applicable skills you want to share here. That's it. Let's have a final look. This will be your resume, and you can create up to three versions and use whichever is better suited when applying for jobs. Check that it is saved as the live version so that you can use it. Let's find out how to use this when applying for jobs. Click view on the job you want to apply for. Next click Apply. 
Fill up all the details here, and if you look at the bottom, you can see your live resumes. Select Share. When you click Apply, the company will be able to access your resume. You can choose to send other documents as well, or if you are not using the resume you created on the site, just attaching a PDF version here is also fine. Something to take note is, this is a live document and if you make changes to the resume after applying, this change will be updated on the company side as well. They will see the latest info, unless maybe they have already printed out your resume. Also, if you go back to the resume builder, you can see the company name of the job you just applied for here. This is to control who sees your resume. Currently it is at all companies. Meaning anyone who you has a link can see it. If you want more control over who sees it, or let's say at a certain point you want to remove access to your resume for a certain company, keep the setting it selected only, then add and remove the company as required. Note that if this resume is listed on Talents Hub, you will only be able to save it as all companies. So now let's see how to list your resume on Talents Hub. Before that, let me log into a corporate account and show you how your resume will be listed on Talents Hub. Okay, we are at Talents Hub now, which is a page available for corporate users only. Once you list your resume on Talents Hub from your personal account, this is how companies will see it. They can filter to find suitable candidates, and when they click the listing, it will take them to your resume. So let's go back to the personal account and go through how to get listed. On the Jobs Portal page, click List on Talents Hub. Step 1 will be to complete your profile to allow the companies to find your resume when they filter based on criteria. You will need to fill this section even if you have added this info in your resume. This is to make listings from all users consistent, and with that improve chances for the most suitable resumes to be found when companies are looking through the resumes. Step 2 will be to select the resume to link to your listing. Lastly, make it the live version and save. That's it. Your resume will be now visible on Talents Hub. You can come here and disable at any time if you wish to remove the listing. Thank you all for watching. Bye.